Alrighty. Welcome back to Paradise Lost. Uh, we are in the Depression chapter. Um, we are back at our checkpoint, so... What is this place? We have a lot. Unfortunately, we're going to be I, redoing a couple here. I grew up here. Didn't you say that you grew up in the village in the mountains? Uh, um. Um. Audio. A little too low. Uh. Uh. Dialogue. There we go. She needs to be a little bit louder. Okay, accept, back, yeah. there we go. And you thought this was it. Shimon, this isn't funny. What is going on here? I don't know. Are you sure this is the place? It is. At least, I think it is. I don't know what to believe anymore. Okay, we read this in the last episode, so we're not going to read it again. We're just going to acknowledge it again. And what's here? This is where we used to gather. My father performed rituals at that altar. They were preparing a ritual for a successful journey. So they left without you? It looks like they didn't finish the ceremony. It's missing some offerings. Without them, their journey won't be successful. That's what they get for leaving you behind. Yeah, I guess. What's wrong? It just doesn't feel right leaving it like this. There you go. I can finish the ceremony if you want. What do we need? Two things. An animal offering and a sacred item. What should we start with? Let's start with... a sacred item. But what makes an item sacred? It's an item that's been blessed by the pastor. Your father. Exactly. I know just where to find one. Go to the living quarters. You'll find it there. What am I looking for? My hairpin. Your hairpin is a sacred item? It was carved from a holy tree. Go straight ahead. We can grab that sacred item since we are already... What does the hairpin look like? My father carved it in there the shape of a bison. At nope, least that's what he glasses. said it was. This is where I last saw it. Maybe in here? I can't find it. I guess we'll have to find something else instead. How about the ring on the draw? Yes, that could work. You just have to bless it, but that's not going to be difficult. Now let's look for an animal offering. There's a workshop behind the stage. We'll find it there. Okay. I wonder what happened to that hairpin. Maybe they took it. No. They knew how important it was to me. I'm sure it will turn up somewhere. E.K.? Those are my initials. Did you do that? No, Antek carved it for me. He got such a talking to after. What does the K stand for? Mm, I don't remember. Hmm. Doesn't remember her last initial. All right, I don't know where I'm going. Okay, we went in there. There's nothing in here but art supplies. Okay.
nothing. Nothing. Oh, there's a bucket. Is this the workshop? A doll? An Are you animal. sure this will work? Don't worry, it's just about symbolism. It looks like we have everything. We can go back to the altar now. Okay, okay. Why were there so many toys there? All the children grew up, and because of the radiation, no new ones were born. The youngest was Antek. When he turned 12, he became an adult. They shaved his head and put all the toys in one place for few. Put the offerings in the bowls. Now bless the items, and the ritual will be complete. How do I do that? Just say a few words. Something profound. The gods like that. How about... Hmm, no matter how dark the night, a new day sun will rise. Yeah, that works. I think we did it. Their journey should be successful now. Hmm. Wherever they went. Thank you for doing this for me. Okay, that's kinda cool. Since you grew up here, and the people from that recording move here, did you recognize any of them? Like Lucian? That scientist? I don't remember anyone like that. At least I don't think I do. Okay, well, where do we go now? Guess we should get this note. Okay. Went this way, I know, but where we got the animal from. No, nope, we did that one. Can't walk in there. This takes us back up. I'm not really sure where we're going now. Is there anywhere else to go? Alright, there's steps this way. Let's try this. I'm glad that we finished the ritual. Their journey should be safe now. There we and go. And maybe ours okay. will be too. What is this place? Go that way. Let's go this way. And what's here? Something isn't right about this place. What do you mean? I just don't remember being here. Okay, nothing. Fuck. Life the book. Tree. It's the same as the one in your mom's drawings. That's Lucian, the man you're looking for. And there's Dominica. They look like they were friends. He changed. He definitely got older. Oh, that is 
always want you, baby. Sarah, your photo fits in this space, but that doesn't make any sense. It would mean that the baby is you? Why did you leave it there? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're stuck. Uh... see we're gonna load the checkpoint you will lose your current progress nothing I can do about it I have a tendency of doing this in games so busy checking everything out that I step into places that I shouldn't and then I get stuck okay not bad we're, we're still super I'm close to where we were something isn't right about this place what do you mean all right, I'm we just, just have to look at that book again. So here. I apologize. The tree. It's the same as the one in your mom's drawings. That's Flutzy and the man you're looking for. And there's the Monica. They look like they were friends. She changed. She definitely got older. Is one cute baby. So, your photo fits in this space, but that doesn't make any sense. It would mean that the baby is you. Okay, don't go over there. Imagine what you're going through learning that Lucian is your father. He will never be my father. And I don't want to talk about it. Okay, just... Yeah, okay. <clears throat> oh, wow. It must be your father's... Oh, I mean... Lucian's study. I leave Who this with you. To save? When the time comes, it's the gods who will judge my actions. I will stand before them. I will look them in the eyes and I will not blink. Because I know that one cannot have a higher purpose than devoting their whole life to saving their loved ones. Getting cold. 
<laughs> Alright, let's read this one now. <clears throat> Brothers and sisters, we do not know when we shall leave this bunker. We must fend for ourselves, and it warms my heart to see the spirit of camaraderie among us each and every day. Yet events have transpired that are hard to explain rationally. Ugh, whatever. Found a new tunic when his old one could no longer be patched up. Uh, Zubuchawa. Found a new hoe after her old one broke. And Zedric returned to health, though we never knew what afflicted him or how to cure it. The list goes on. I have the feeling that someone is watching over us and recently has given us a sign. Fate's tangled path has brought us to the kingdom of Vales, the Slavic god of the waters of the underworld, yet also of song and poetry. I feel it is he who is behind all of these marvels. He is giving us signs so that we will believe. Let us erect an altar and statue to worship him so that we may win his favor and his aid. Alrighty. Maybe up there? Can we talk about what just happened? I don't think I want to. Let's just focus on our goal. The control room should be close. Sure. Alright, there's no way up there, so we have to go this you way. You live here with other people? As far as I remember. Where did they all go? They must have left just before you got here. <sighs> I don't think you're telling the truth. So, you grew up here, underground. Do you remember the world outside? Sure I do. Before the bombs hit, I had a normal life on the surface. Before the bombs hit? Wasn't that like 20 years ago? That doesn't make any sense. It's like a memorial trail. No picture for this one. This one either. closed off so is that one okay let's keep going <laughs> she's not talking to him anymore was your friend, wasn't it? Was he really so young when it happened? I'm so sorry, Emma. for those <laughs> Is this the right path? I don't know I 
don't want to be here anymore. It can't be much further. Please, you need to help me. I don't know how. Eva? Your name's on the grave. What's going on here? I... I don't... I don't remember. I don't want to remember. Orlando? That's his name. You're his daughter. Stop it. I don't want to hear it. You should never have come here. But you wanted me to help you. You can't help me. No one can. This place was built on lies and death. There's only pain here. I'm not going to suffer anymore. I'm shutting it down. It's over. You hear me? It's over. Eva? Eva? If he's your father, then I will say you, sis. Whether you want me to or not. Come on, please let there be a switch to turn that off. Close it all up on him. The side the dot didn't show up. It got a little bit quieter. Thankfully. Holy hell, right? Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but I guess we're doing it. Huh. dark.
pin, so we'll be together. I made sure of that, but I can't shake the feeling that I'm forgetting something. Stop. The faithful need not be afraid. The faithful are protected. It's cause and effect. Cause and effect. As for the others, we must hope for the best and prepare for the worst. If anything happens, just remember to monitor their heart rates. There's no need for anything drastic. So, this is it for me, huh? Do what you want. I refuse to be part of your twisted little fantasy any longer. Faithful are no more. They brought the wrath of the gods upon themselves. Do you understand? They are to blame. But we are still together. Everyone who matters is all right. What happened to her? where we came in.
This is where we came in. to determine where I should be going. This is just like a dead end, I guess. Back in the elevator? Oh wait, there's a lat. Is this a ladder? Sure looks like it, but... Alright, can we go this way? No. in here. the ladder. Dear Professor, preliminary research indicates that the rapid consumption of biocomponents is due to stress caused by constant stimulation from electrical impulses combined with the enormous amount of information being processed. Excessive stress promotes hypothalamic pituitary adrenal axis activity in turn causing the excretion of, among others, cortisol, thereby damaging the hippocampus. No further factual data is available at this time. Regarding our hypothesis, we currently have one. The excellent conditions in which the biocomponents are raised increases the processing power of the system to which they are attached. Yet the use of solely positive reinforcement, reinforcement during rearing increases the release of dopamine and creates an addiction to it. This contributes to a lack of stress resistance and coping mechanisms. We should investigate the effect of introducing a more stressogenic rearing method. All right. We'll be right back to you, Ladder. I want to go this way first. And I want to check these other rooms. Okay. 
let's do this one. So we're gonna get to that one from up above, I guess. Let's check this out. Science log. Dr. Rudolf Schroeder noted his findings of the biocomponents hippocampus suffer the most stress during excessive use of the system. What he failed to notice was that there were numerous ways to counter the stress through non-invasive methods. Precautions such as limiting the number of operations the biocomponent can work on simultaneously or applying a shift work system to most day-to-day -day operations can greatly decrease the stress the biocomponent is subjected to. We have already exceeded the longevity of the most durable biocomponents by a factor of 10. This is even more impressive considering we are only operating with a single host. Unfortunately, there is no denying that there is a substantial deterioration in the biocomponent's memory. Delusions are also becoming increasingly frequent. For this reason and this reason alone, I have decided to conduct a physical procedure injecting the biocomponent with a modified version of a drug cocktail the Nazis formulated to create an uber soldier is, I must rather say, rather worrying, since no such experiments have previously been carried out, but the situation is dire. Great. So this is where you spend all of your time? I mean, you come? I came to talk. Not right now. I know we haven't seen eye to eye for a very long time. But I wanted to put our differences aside, and come here to extend my condolences. Thank you. But I have to get back to work. That's the other thing I wanted to talk to you about. People at the processing plant are worried. No one's seen you since the funeral. I've been busy. As I said, I need to get back to work. I understand that's how you operate, but this obsession... Not healthy. Wait. The plant isn't overloading the system, is it? No. Everything's working fine. People are calling it a miracle. Good. Good. I can't imagine what it's like to lose a child. Dominica, I don't have time for it. Time for what? Grieving the death of your daughter? You don't understand. I can still do something. She's gone, Lucian. You can't bring her back. There's not going to be a second miracle. Just you wait and see. So... He faked her death? Of course there's something way back here. Let's see what it is. Come on. Science log from Lucian. It's undeniable that the drugs used by the Nazis have beneficial results on the host when, and I cannot stress enough how important this is, used correctly. Any alteration in the formula, however slight, could be fatal. I found the side effects to be particularly useful, especially considering the current situation among the colonists. There may come a point at which we need to defend ourselves. It's gas form, however, it's not easy to contain. That's why I deemed it necessary to create a vaccine, which I will administer to the believers. There is no reason to risk the well-being of those who decided to trust me. I just need to make sure they take it, but that should not be difficult. They will do anything if they think it will strengthen their faith in gods. A medically enhanced ritual wine will do just fine. Wow. There's nothing there. Okay. So we're back to that room with the ladder. Oh, we can go down there too. But I want to go up first on the ladder. Let's see what that does. 
what's back here. Another thing. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Eva. Happy birthday to you. I've got a present for you. This? It's your little brother. You'll never be alone again. We just have to give him some time before he's big enough to join you. What do you mean you don't want him to? Who are you talking to? I'm just talking to our sweet little boy. I can't get enough of him. She wanted me to join her. But where? Your memory tubes. Okay. Up. Ah. That's the memory. Wait, where'd it go? There it is. That's the memory tubes, right? So empty, and then the tree of life. This stuff's all on. Log. Nazi neurobiological research team sought to transfer information between the hippocampal neurons responsible for memory and spatial perception. Previously, three method methods for achieving this were known. The Nazi team, however, discovered a fourth via the jumping of electrical impulses. They experimented on human hippocampal cross sections and found that low level vibration can create, can generate magnetic poles, which in turn activate neighboring cells. Neurons, thus, may communicate with electrochemical synaptic transmission even when surgically separated. Therefore, neuron signals within the brain can be transmitted without any actual contact. This was the foundation of how they handled the communication between the two biocomponents. The two most durable hosts were connected between March 1945 and August 1947. They lasted longer and were more efficient than any other pair of bio components. The Nazis never made the connection as to why they functioned better than any previous pair of hosts. The hosts' names were Alex Sikorsky and Michael Sikorsky. Siblings. Ah. go downstairs. And that's where we're going to leave today's episode. Acceptance will be the next episode. And I believe that that'll be the final one. Um, but until then, I hope you're enjoying 
uh, the story, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.